Good morning, James. I'm glad you could make it. So this will be your new work area. Your desk is right over there by the window and you have a fascinating view on our homegrown apple tree. I'm not quite sure you understand the gravity of the situation here. My name is Darren Blue Sky Thinking from Creative Visions Creative Limited. I was called here by your manager to take care of certain indiscriptances in the workflow of certain individuals, namely, you. Safe. What do you mean? Listen up honey. I'm only going to say this once. I was here last week to inquire about booking an audio session for my TV ad. In the process I also inquired about possibly receiving certain services from your company in the form of a Cleveland steamer. Ring a bell sister? I'm not quite sure I... Safe. Creative. Sir, what did you say your name was? Darren. Darren Blue Sky Thinking. Look. When I first came here it was all about business. All I wanted was to record sound effects for my TV ad. But then when I saw you, I don't know I guess it just hit me that you were meant to be the person to administer my Cleveland steamer. It is not often that I stumble upon such a creative hip person as yourself. Got that? Nice. Now get to work. Mister. I'm getting really tired of this. Could you at least explain to me what a Cleveland steamer is? I think you might be a likable guy, but you keep speaking in riddles to me, using words that I have never ever heard of before. So what exactly is a Cleveland steamer? Well, I could show you. You seem to be good with words Mr. Blue Sky thinking. Why don't you just explain it? For fuck's sake. You are really starting to piss me off ma'am. Okay. Fine. Open up your ears, because once I finish this sentence my pants will be automatically catapulted to the bottom of the ceiling and there will be no turning back for the both of us. Go on. Wicked. Creative. The Cleveland steamer is a colloquial term for a form of coprophilia, where one defecates on another's chest then rocks back and forth imitating the motion of a steam roller. Nice. Although the term Cleveland steamer is in reference to the specific world first location of a sexual movie it is said to have first been founded during the early 1920s in dispute. The term received news attention through its use in a U.S. Congress staff hoax email and being addressed by the United States Federal Communications Commission. Ma'am. Where did you go? Son of a bitch. Well. I guess I'm going to get some lunch. Anyone interested to come along?